This video is for educational purposes only. Please use these tools responsibly and legally. What if I told you that with just a phone number, you could uncover a mountain of information? Today, I'm revealing 10 insane, completely free WhatsApp OSINT tools used by hackers, investigators, and even the FBI. These tools can reveal names, social media profiles, and more, like having a digital superpower. I spent over 100 hours testing every single one to find the absolute best for you. Some are so powerful, it's wild they're public. We'll break down each one step by step, showing exactly how they work and what you can find. Buckle up, your understanding of digital privacy is about to be shattered. Ready to see what's hiding in plain sight? Let's dive in. First up, WhatsApp Web Tracker. This tool lets you see every time a specific WhatsApp account connects to WhatsApp Web. No access to their phone needed. It leverages public status indicators to log sessions start, end, and duration. Over time, you can build a detailed graph of someone's daily routine just from their WhatsApp web usage. For cybersecurity, it's a way to spot unauthorized access or odd activity times. Hackers might use this to time phishing attacks when a target is distracted. OSINT researchers use it to verify if someone's online activity matches their claims. It's not about reading messages, but about understanding the metadata, the digital breadcrumbs we all leave behind. WhatsApp Web Tracker is passive, powerful, and paints a picture using overlooked data points. It's a silent alarm for suspicious activity. The implications are huge, and it's all from a free tool scraping public data. Whether you're defending or investigating, this is a must-have in your toolkit. We're just getting started. The next tool unmasks the person behind the number. Let's keep going. 15. Next, TrueCaller a tool you might already have but probably aren't using to its full potential. It's not just for blocking spam, it's a global crowdsourced intelligence database. Type in a number and you'll likely get a name, sometimes even a profile picture or email. TrueCaller works by pooling contact lists from millions of users, making even obscure numbers searchable. For investigators, it's often the first step, turning an anonymous number into a real lead. Hackers use it to verify targets or build lists for phishing. Details like profile pictures or emails can be cross-checked elsewhere for more info. It's a gateway to deeper investigation, reverse image search, breach checks, and more. TrueCaller is the fastest way to put a name to a number, unlocking countless other doors. In intelligence gathering, a name is everything. It's the key to unraveling bigger stories. Now, what if you want to find their social media? That's where our next tool comes in. Tool three is Icon, a game changer for finding social media profiles. While TrueCaller gets you a name, Icon links a phone number directly to social accounts like Facebook and Instagram. Enter a number and Icon scours the web for any public-facing profile tied to it. You can go from just a number to seeing their photos, friends, and posts in seconds. For investigators, this means instant access to someone's digital life, social circles, interests, even geotagged locations. Hackers can use this to gather personal info for phishing or password resets. Icon bridges the gap between a phone number and a person's social world. It's incredibly powerful for mapping digital footprints. We've gone from session tracking to names and now to full social media presence. The picture gets clearer with each tool. Next, let's look at a tool that aggregates data from even more sources. Tool 4 is Sync.me, a data aggregator that pulls public info from across the internet and links it to a phone number. Unlike Icon, Sync.me goes broader, pulling from social networks, public records, and more. Its search function cross-references a massive, constantly updated database. If other tools come up empty, Sync.me might find an old profile or forum mention. Recruiters and sales pros use it to enrich contact lists. OSINT investigators use it to crack tough cases. The potential for misuse is real. Stalkers could gather unnerving amounts of info from just a number. Sync.me shows how harmless data points can combine into a detailed, sometimes invasive profile. It's your go-to when specialized tools fail, casting the widest net. Now, what if the number isn't linked to a profile, but just mentioned somewhere? Our next tool finds those digital breadcrumbs. Tool five is Social Searcher, a deep cut OSINT tool. Instead of identifying the owner, it scours the internet and social media for any public mention of a phone number. People post their numbers in ads, forums, or social posts more often than you'd think. Social Searcher uses advanced search operators to find these mentions across dozens of platforms. For investigators, it's like finding a needle in a digital haystack, maybe a bike ad from years ago with a name, location, and timestamp. It's also great for reputation management. Search your own number to see where it's exposed. 
Hackers can use it to find vulnerable targets or business numbers for social engineering. Social Searcher fills a unique gap, finding where a number has been, not just who owns it. It's about uncovering forgotten digital breadcrumbs. Once something's online, it's often there forever. Next, let's analyze the number itself for more clues. 14. Tool 6 is numbering plans, a fundamental for any investigation. It breaks down a phone number to reveal the country, original carrier, and sometimes even the city or region. Enter a number, and it decodes the country code, area code, and carrier block. For investigators, this reveals if a number is local, international, or VoIP, crucial for understanding the operation. It helps verify claims. Someone says they're in New York, but the number's from Florida. That's a red flag. Hackers use this to craft believable phishing scams tailored to the carrier or region. Numbering plans is your technical analysis tool, quick, simple, and essential for any number you investigate. Now, let's see how to find even more tools for your OSINT arsenal. Tool 7 is the OSINT framework, a legendary resource in the intelligence community. It's a web-based mind map organizing hundreds of OSINT tools by category, including a whole section for phone numbers. Start at the center, branch out to categories like carrier lookup, reputation, and more. The framework is actively maintained, so it's always current. It saves you hours searching for the right tool and is perfect for both beginners and pros. For learning or quick reference, it's indispensable. Bookmark it. It's your gateway to thousands of possibilities. The OSINT framework embodies the spirit of sharing knowledge and resources. Now let's get back to WhatsApp and find some groups. Tool 8 is the WhatsApp Group Link Finder. It scours the web for publicly posted WhatsApp group invitation links, collecting them in a searchable database. Investigators can search for names or usernames to discover group memberships, hobbies, affiliations, even criminal enterprises. Observing these groups can reveal more than public profiles ever could, but ethical and legal lines are blurry. Joining under false pretenses is a gray area. Use this technique with caution and a strong understanding of the law. The group link finder shifts your focus from individuals to their communities. It's about understanding networks, not just nodes. Now, let's talk about getting location details from a number. Tool 9 is a mobile tracker, the Mobile Location Sleuth. It provides location and carrier details for a mobile number, narrowing it down to a city or region. It analyzes area codes and prefixes, and can tell if a number is standard, virtual, or VoIP. For investigators, this helps focus efforts. If a number is registered in Miami, but the case is in Chicago, that's a lead. Hackers use this to localize scams, making them more convincing. E-Mobile Tracker squeezes every drop of info from a number's digits. It's not magic, but it's logical data analysis for probable location and type. For our final tool, let's look at a public records powerhouse. Tool 10 is Spokio, a full-blown people search engine. It aggregates data from online sources, social media, and public records, property, court, addresses, and more. Enter a number, and Spokio can link it to names, addresses, relatives, emails, even wealth data. For investigators, it's essential for finding people, assets, or hidden relationships. Spokio connects the dots, making public data easily accessible. The potential for misuse is huge. Identity theft, stalking, harassment. It's a stark reminder of how little privacy we have. Spokio takes a single data point and can build a complete dossier. It's the final boss of OSINT tools. There you have it. 10 powerful, free, WhatsApp OSINT tools the pros use every day. We've tracked online activity, uncovered identities, found social profiles, and even technical origins. The amount of info you can gather from a few digits is mind-blowing. Use these tools ethically and within the law. The power comes with responsibility. This knowledge is for defense and discovery, not deception. Let me know in the comments which tool blew your mind. Like, comment, and subscribe for more. Stay curious, stay safe, and see you in the next video. 8.